back on the track man yes this is dawn's brown tv yes man me say my brethren me telling them i love on the man those have been waiting a long time to hear what i have to say yes enough respect to all my youtube subscribers and if it's your first time on this channel don't forget to subscribe share like and comment which is ex putin to end ukraine invasions that's what we're going to deal with right now yes man they've ex the police the taliban and even president trump but now a group of witches are taking on their mightiest forever russian president Vladimir putin on March 2nd, a group of witches held a mass ritual to curse Putin and aid Ukraine as they remain besieged by the Russian military. The global ritual was organized by Michael M. Huge, author of Magic for the Resistance, Ritual and Spells for Change, and was such a success that future events will be held every new moon until Ukraine is free or already planned for the future. Can the power of magic defeat Putin? How to ex Putin? According to Huge, you will need a variety of household items and if you intend to join the next ex. Blue candle, yellow candle, and full of sunflowers seed matches or lighter a ashtray a gordon or a other fireproof vessel photo of putin to burn hmm. after lighting the candle and blessing ukraine the exes proper began with a curse against putin muttered aloud including these words valdemir valdemorich putin you are cursed. You are bound. May you choke on the seeds of sunflowers. May your soldiers refuse to flight or fight. May your people rise up against you, break your bones, and cast you down into dust and ashes. The ritual end by burning the photo of Putin. An ex-organizer recommend purifying yourself in a salt bath or anointing oils afterward the putin x aimed to bring a whole constellation of rebound effect on putin while breaking the support of his soldiers and people and supporting ukraine say huge the best goal imaginable is ukraine beating back russian troop and the russian people deciding they are done with putin or crosses atrocity that's what we all want he acknowledged that it's ambitious but in his word with a f put in it's time for the russian people to serve up some cold russian justice he um here isn't this isn't huge first x rodeo he led witches the world over in exes against police, the Taliban, the former president, and at least one case, it seems they might have succeeded. Does do exes work? Witches have been ritualistic college causing Donald Trump since um, ritual, witches have been ritualistic cursing Donald Trump's since he took office as president. And in 2020, many felt the question, do X's work, was answered when he was diagnosed with COVID-19. Trump diagnosed came on the 1st of October during a full moon, which happened to be the 2020 harvest moon, an important event symbolizing the changing of the seasons. Basically, this was the most superpower full moon of the year and trump was diagnosed with covid that very evening perhaps with tongues particularly in cheek many witches took a victory lap 
as they felt validated after years of fighting mega with magic. Mm. For those involved with the magical resistance, these exes are an important part of expressing their faith, but also finding communities. The witchcraft movement has grown from niche to relatively popular in just a few short years. Whether exes are the answer to solving world conflict, however, remain to be seen. What do you think? Will the effort to exporting be effective? My viewers and subscribers, I really want to laugh, but, you know, because these things, I don't believe in these things, but they exist. People do get out of the fact and do, we call them sometimes hobia, another said juju, another said a debia man and the rodeo of these episodes continue and people believe in them and now the exes and the warlocks and the wizard and the sorcerers they are there but are they effective that's the question here do you think that they can work their their magic on putin to overcome him so that the ukrainians can live in peace and like they said that is the mightiest foe that they will have to come up against what are your views on this let me your views because there's a whole lot of things in this magic thing you know a whole lot of things with the sorcerers and the witches and the warlocks and the demonic world and a lot of you might be putting it but it's out there and it's real trust me when i tell you that and they can back it up to show you that these things are real. But it's how much do you put yourself in it? And where do you stand when it comes to that? Let me your views on this. Let me hear you talk. Don't just watch the thing. Just lend, shut in your shots there, man. And let me see how much we can block. That's how the thing run. So once again, this is Dawn Brown's TV. Watch, you know. Walk in peace. Shalom.